Hi, I'm Donald George, a professor of voice at the Grain School of Music in SUNY Potsdam. We have dug up a lot of the music of Margaret Lang. She's a composer I'm very interested in. And the sad fact about Margaret Lang is that in 1920 she stopped composing. She was quite well known, quite famous. And for some reason she decided to retreat from fame. And she lived until 1972. And she basically destroyed most of her music. So what you heard last night was an orchestra piece that we managed to find at the New England Conservatory of Music. They had this music with the orchestra parts Somebody had not sent it back to her, luckily, but had probably thrown it on a back shelf where it's remained for a hundred years, probably in a box someplace. It was a bit funny because last night, while we were in the middle of Grant We Beseech Thee, O Lord, one of her church pieces, we had a fire alarm. We all had to leave the building for 30 minutes. And uh, somebody said as we walked out, that was Margaret Lang's ghost telling us not to record this. It was her own personal decision, I guess, but many composers have done this. Our artists have destroyed their work, writers have destroyed their work. She destroyed this around 1920 when the Romantic era was over and we were starting to get into modern and more atonal, dissonant things. And although she kept going to the symphony orchestra, maybe she didn't like that kind of music so much and she felt her music was outdated or something. But it's still quite, it's beautiful and I think it's well worth hearing music from the American Romantic era, you know, there aren't too many of us and she's one of them. So if we can find a few things to, to show and that the audience or public can enjoy, I think it's quite worth it.